All right, we are here with Mike Buslup, the head coach of Romeo Cross Country. Of course, uh, the boys taking the D1 state title here today at MIS. Um, with all the uncertainties <laughs> with this season, you know, with COVID and everything else, to, to get this, what does it mean for you and what does it mean for this team? You know, um, when this went down in March, one of the things that we always said is, you know, we just, we have to stay fit to the day we can actually go out there and, you know, do this thing again. Nice Thank you. And, uh, you know, that's one of those things that we believed in. We didn't want to take this for granted. Um, we, I think it just made us appreciate the sport and the opportunity a heck of a lot better. And this was kind of, honestly, it was a de-stressor with everything else we've been dealing with. And when we got to the beginning of the season, we really just focused on just getting better. We didn't talk about winning the state title or anything like that. And, you know, once the season started progressing, we knew it was just more and more of an opportunity. But we just took every single week at a time and, you know, just appreciated the opportunity that we had. And we're so thankful the state, you know, was able to work really, really hard to kind of put this together, give us an opportunity. And it's a test of my guys. We didn't have, uh, you know, they really took this seriously. We didn't have any cases of COVID on our team, thankfully. And, uh, you know, they just, they, they wanted to do this thing correctly, and they did. I'm really more proud of them. Talk about the seven guys that really stood out for you um, overall this year. You know, obviously our one-two punch, you know, Jack and Xander were awesome, you know. You know, Xander's like one of those guys, if you even go look at what he did as a freshman, if any kid says they can't be good in the sport, just look at what he was able to do. I mean, he was a 1950, 20-minute runner, didn't think he was going to be a runner as a freshman, and he went out there and finished fourth in the state today. So that's just a testament to hard work. It's not always about talent, it's about how much you want to work. And these guys were just a bunch of workhorses. They believed in the program, they believed in the system, and every opportunity they had this year, they took advantage of it. And we got a good young squad. Um, you know, I'm, I'm happy to see Joey Rinke end his season with an all-state performance this year. Year, uh, it's just incredible. Another guy just, you know, made the made the low pack JV runner his freshman year, and just, you know, just stuck with it. So, yeah. Um, and of course, you know, just to wrap this up, uh, a good cross country season, and uh, with all well, with all the uncertainties getting through it, well, to culminate with the state title, that that's got to be. It's that's awesome. Be. We uh, we finally. We finally got over the hump, and I know just the alumni in the program is going to be really, really proud of today. So uh, it is the first of uh, hopefully more in the future. So, all right, congrats, Mike, right, and thank, uh, you. thank you so much. All right, thank you.